Good morning, Polly's Island peeps. Today is Fantastic Friday. And it is September 10th, 2021. And it's time for your Polly's Island sunrise and surf report with Cindy. Anslow and Debbie Cooper. And Holly Servini. And Margo Waltz. And David Fellinger. You get in the picture? All of you. And of course your special guest. David Clayton. Good morning, everybody. Can't forget Laurel. Good morning to you, Laurel. Gosh, what a morning. Can you believe this? Good, good morning, Cheryl. How are you, sweetie? How are you? Good to see you. Good morning to you. What a nice morning. My brother is here. Oh, wonderful. Can you believe the sky? It's amazing. I hope I wasn't walking into your shot. You were. It was great. <laughs> we were all commenting on your attire. You look great. <laughs> I've never seen this man before in my life. <laughs> That's what I figured, you're good so morning. Yeah. Good morning to you, Lily, sir. How are you, good morning. Good does, does Cheryl always wake up this happy? This is, the, is she a morning person? It's only when I get well, to Polly's Island Beach. That's what I have to say because I'm her older brother. Aww. She is usually pretty good in the morning. I am. I'm usually up at 5 35, 15 anyway. Even uh, when I come down he's here. still working. It's the best sucker. part of the day. Oh, that's great. It's beautiful. Isn't it gorgeous? It's amazing. It's I was in on Monday night, and since Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we didn't come out Wednesday, but the past couple days we've seen some awesome, awesome sunrises here. The sky's been very awesome. I don't let them sleep in. So I'm going to test you on the conditions this morning. Okay. This is going to be a test. What would you say the air temperature is this very moment right now? It's 64 degrees. Right on the money. Degrees. 65, right on the money. I'm Must old be beach that coma. Nautilus I'm an old beach temperature <laughs> gauge. <laughs> nice little gale. What's, gonna, what's it going to go on? What's it going to go 80 up? 80 degrees. Very close. One degree warmer, according to oh, Ed. Eddie said 81. Eddie, 80, 81. All right. <laughs> He'll get a paycheck no matter what he We've says. We've been coming down here for 90, 90, uh, since 98. So what's it, 24 years, 25 years almost? So That's great. We know this area. We never take it for granted. And now Cheryl lives here. Yep. And you don't live here. I don't. But I visit as often as I can. Have you seen a change in Cheryl's joy since she's moved here in her uh, personality? Let me, let me think. Yes. Have you? <laughs> you didn't have to think very long. I did. No. As soon as I crossed that Mason Dixon line, no, I had a there's no attitude turning back. adjustment. Oh, you're Born fun. in the north, but got here as fast as I could. You're Everybody's funny. Everybody's like that down here. Gosh. Oh, it's just the, the yeah, area. It's a joyful place. How, how can you really not is. find joy in this? This is God's work. Amen. It's crazy. So how about the ocean temperature? Give me a guess. Uh, 63 74. degrees. <laughs> Am I close? Cheryl's closer. All Cheryl, right. Is it still 70? It is warmer, much warmer than 70. Really? I'm the, surprised. The ocean temperature is 82 degrees. Okay. Is it really? It is. Now, we've, we've waited. We haven't swam since I've been down here yet, but we go in. Yeah. It's very comfortable here. Very cool. You're so knowledgeable, Dave. No, I, I just have an app that has information. <laughs> okay. 
and this informational app, I just memorize it. I sit in the oh, truck. Good. I sit in the truck and memorize it right before I come out. Well, I'm glad we were students and we are not being paid for we're, this endorsement. We're not done. We're not done. You're just starting. Okay. So would you say the tide is coming in or is going low tide? I have this awesome tide clock. That mm -hmm. I purchased so we from someone. And I also watched and, the channel and this morning on right the title. Right at the low tide, yep. Because <laughs> we like to know the high and low and half tides. We know tides. these things. Yeah, you're so... <laughs> well, you can tell this has just gone out. I yes. mean, if you've been on the beach a couple times in your life. That's okay, right. all right. Don't go. Don't be too so New the tide, So the tide actually, right now, is beginning to come in. Yeah, it'll roll in. Yes, yeah, so it, about 5 o'clock this morning, mm -hmm. it, was, it, mm -hmm. was, it was officially... Low. low and so it is starting to come in now two hours ago, right? and so high tide's going to be at 11. Okay. okay and then it's going to be low again this afternoon around five ish yeah cool. so there you go what would you say the um, the wave height is this morning three uh, feet two or three feet okay what do you think it is that, that's that's it. i think you're right mostly it's about two foot waves and they're how many seconds apart Probably Six three seconds, seconds apart. <laughs> They're closer I don't know. than that. They're three seconds apart. So there's there's a primary swell, mm -hmm. which is 15 seconds apart right now. Okay. A primary swell. So that's the the biggest wave you're seeing. Yep. And then there's a couple of secondary okay. swells. Okay. One's at three seconds and one's at five seconds. Okay. So it's a little bit what they call like a messy sea. But the the primary swell, the one the surfers are really interested in is about 15 seconds apart which is outstanding so they can get out there. right not they're not so worried about that but they're 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 a lot more fun to ride yeah. because the longer the swell the more they can build understood physics yeah yeah i love it it's awesome so the big the big news this morning is how cool it feels it feels wonderful well the humidity is, is lifted you're going to right. feel the cooler temperatures because of the blanket. Right. The sky is opened up. It's a little breeze. And the surfers are on their way. I bet they are. They are. So do you remember where you were September 11th? I sure was. I was working 20 years ago in Albany, New York at the Twin Towers. Wow. In Albany, New York. We all had our TV sets on. We actually watched the second plane hit the tower. Gosh. Mm. Yeah, we had a lot of panicked people. Sure. Yep. Yep. Frightening days. Gives me chills. Yeah. Even to think about that tragedy. Yeah. So I had to bring that up because it's... Well, tomorrow, right? Tomorrow's the day. And yeah, yeah, I'm flying my sister out tomorrow for a couple of days. I hope she'll be safe. But yeah. I told her she will be. Things will be on high alert tomorrow, but I don't think we're going to see any issues. I'm just... A lot of prayers tomorrow and a lot of thought, you know? Sure. Yeah, yeah. For the families that have been yeah. so greatly affected. Yeah. And... There are some brave heroes right now. Amen. Since that day that, like, someone like Mike Fanning that's here now, who, uh knew so many people that were part of that tragedy yeah. but have continued to serve and continued to just yeah. something else it's their mission yeah That's what they do yeah and they'd step up again these people sure. are born of a different ilk you know what I mm -hmm. mean? it's a beautiful sunrise so do you come out every day and follow this? We do. Much? We do. We come out every day and um, nice. about a year and a half ago, we were, we realized we hadn't been to the beach in months mm -hmm. and Lisa and I were just in a real funk. My wife is Lisa mm -hmm. and um, yeah. we decided to start coming out and as an accountability, we would go live and our friends have joined us. So now... We have friends from all over that join us, like Cheryl. Yeah, nice. 
And uh, that's how we met her initially, Cheryl and I. Yeah, she posts live some days. Yeah. Oh, here comes our big ball of fire. We're, we're chiming in. Yeah, we chime in up north for I, a log I to work at 7 o'clock. I this or not, but you both have a great fake face. Well, See, this is a God thing. I'm yeah. sorry. He was, we could have yeah. been down on the north end <laughs> or the south end, mm -hmm. but we met in the middle. Well, that's one of the things morning. we do in the mornings. We yeah. share the good news. Amen. And so the good news today, isn't that great? It. I love it. Today's good news comes from Proverbs. I'm going to have you read it. It's going to be, if you have your eyes on. I put my eyes right on. I'd be proud to read it. It's going to be right here in the comments. And it's a short one. Did you said enough already. I'd be proud to read it. All right. Let's see. Any second, it's going to pop up right there. Who posts the Proverbs? There it is, right Please. there. Proverbs 8, verse 35. For those who find me find life and receive it and receive favor from the Lord. Amen. I love Proverbs. Me too. Great prophet. How, how can't you not understand that? Finding me and finding life. Mm -hmm. That's where we're standing here, man. What a gorgeous morning. Thank you, Holly. That's awesome. It's a God I thing. I think those breakers mm -hmm. are coming in. Look at that golden Hi. orb. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put my coffee cup down and get a quick shot of Do this. Do it, yeah. Well, I never thought I'd be on live this morning from Holly. <laughs> this is a God thing. <laughs> oh, she just said that. <laughs> Funny. Life is awesome. Oh, that's gonna come out awesome. Nice. Wow, that's that perfect. Well, if you don't believe in anything, take another look, right? Look at that reflection right off the side of the. Uh, sand ice see that other you'll get that reflection right off the downside of the angle of the beach mm -hmm. nice well my peeps up north will appreciate that while they're working up north look at that come right up nice Have you ever had an experience where you were searching for God or wisdom? Have you ever had an experience that might come to your mind, folks, where you were searching for answers or maybe searching for Savior? The good news today tells us that when we search, that he will allow us to find him. Because guess what? We're chosen by him. And the favor of the Lord does not mean riches. Solomon, King Solomon was talking about wisdom was talking about just the presence of the Lord the sheer presence of our Creator is favor do you all get that how incredible that is this morning yeah this morning we receive favor because we found the Lord. He's found us. Amen. Thanks a lot. 
awesome. Isn't that beautiful? That is speechless. No words. So as we sign out and I head back to take Chelsea to school. Thanks be to God. Yes, amen. May God bless you. Amen. And may God keep you. And may God help you make his choices today and, and every, day. every day. Signing out. Cheryl. Peace out. <laughs> Love we're, the Lord. We're signing out, Cheryl. <laughs> My happy friend, Cheryl, you're great. Dave, you're awesome. You're awesome, too. We're signing out. God bless y'all. Boop.